Do you want to see where some of the biggest stars like Jennifer Aniston, Elvis Presley, and Justin Bieber call home? Well, today I am taking you on a walking and driving tour with a sprinkle of history of one of the most exclusive neighborhoods in Los Angeles and home to billionaires and A-list celebrities, Truesdale Estates. Stay tuned until the very end because I tell you one of the best streets in all of Beverly Hills. I'm Ashley Novak with Novak Schultz Real Estate Group at Compass. And if this is your first time to the channel, welcome. And if you wanna know everything about living in the South Bay and LA area, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification button so you can live like an LA local. Whether you're looking to make a move now or just planning ahead for your future, all of our information is in the description below and we would love to hear from you. Call, text, email, or schedule a Zoom and don't forget to check out our description for neighborhood guides, community tours, and to search for homes in the Los Angeles area. Truesdale Estates is located in the foothills of the Santa Monica Mountains in Beverly Hills, north of Sunset Boulevard, east of Coldwater Canyon, and west of the Bird Streets in West Hollywood, and it stretches out just north of the famous Greystone Mansion. And in the 1950s, prolific real estate developer Paul Truesdale purchased the 410-acre Doheny Ranch, and he created what is now known as the Truesdale Estates neighborhood, which is made up of about 500 homes. So when development began, one acre home sites started at just $40,000, and now it is one of the most expensive neighborhoods in the United States. Mr. Truesdale began his development in 1954, and he sold lots exclusively to celebrities who had hired top architects to design their dream homes. And construction of these homes continued into the 1970s. The most common home designs in Truesdale Estates are modernist and mid-century modern, with the largest concentration of mid-century modern homes in Los Angeles within Truesdale Estates. Truesdale Estates is known for its celebrity residence with US presidents even calling this exclusive enclave home. Some celebrities that have called Truesdale Estates home are Frank Sinatra, Dean Martin, Ray Charles, Orlando Bloom, Elton John, Simon Cowell, and Richard Nixon, just to name a few. Some of Los Angeles' most expensive and prolific properties are located in Truesdale Estates. Garrett Camp, former CEO of Uber, paid $72 million in 2019 for his newly built home. Homes in the neighborhood widely vary in price from as low as $6 million up to around $100 million. And as of August, 2023, the median home price is just over $8 million, which is down 10% from 2022. Newly enacted Measure ULA, also known as the mansion tax, combined with interest rate hikes, have slowed sales in the luxury market. If A-list celebrities who can live anywhere live in Truesdale Estates, why is that? There are a few reasons. One is the breathtaking views. Truesdale Estates occupies the highest terrains in Beverly Hills, so you get amazing panoramic views of the Santa Monica Mountains, Pacific Ocean, and downtown Los Angeles. A huge plus to living in Truesdale Estates is the Truesdale Ordinance that was passed by the Truesdale Estates HOA and City of Beverly Hills in 1987. The ordinance has height and building restrictions in place so you don't block your neighbor's views and the ordinance helps maintain the charm and character of the neighborhood. Homes must be at least 3,000 square feet and can only be one story. This is a huge plus because in many parts of Los Angeles, you are one sail away from having an epic view turned into a non-existent view. And as you drive through Truesdale Estates, you'll see new development everywhere, but this ordinance protects the residents and the integrity of the neighborhood that Mr. Truesdale had in mind when he initially developed. Another reason Truesdale Estates is so sought after is because Truesdale Estates is close enough to all the action, but far enough away that you have privacy and peace. You're a short distance to fine dining, shopping, restaurants, and all the hot spots of the West Side and West Hollywood. But when you're up here, it's quiet and serene, so you get the best of both worlds. For people with children, you're located in the top ranked Beverly Hills Unified School District and a short distance to some of the best private schools in the city and in the country. Now I'm gonna take you on a drive through Truesdale Estates, which consists of about 20 streets, but we are going to drive through the top five streets for you to check out. 
The number five street in Truesdale Estates is Carla Ridge. It is located on a ridge and both sides of the street have views. On the east side, you get views of downtown Los Angeles and on the west side, you get views of the Pacific Ocean. The number four street in Truesdale Estates is Chalette Drive, which is about a mile and a half long and it's a quiet street because it goes from Loma Vista to Carla Ridge, so there's no shortcut to get there, so you won't have the through traffic that other streets do. The number three street in Truesdale Estates is Robert Lane. Robert Lane is one of the most admired and private streets in Truesdale Estates. It's a wide tree-lined street with only 11 houses on the street. Every lot is over an acre, so it's high-profile residents have the privacy that they need. The number two street in Truesdale Estates is Truesdale Place, which is 75 to 80% of Truesdale Estates, and you have great views because there's pretty much nobody in front of you. Truesdale Place is a cul-de-sac, so you have minimal traffic, and Simon Cow once owned a home on Truesdale Place. The number one most sought after street in Truesdale Estates is Hillcrest Road. And it is the best street in Truesdale Estates and Beverly Hills, and it's known as Billionaire's Row. Hillcrest Road was also once home to the King Elvis Presley and has some of the best 180 degree views in the city. Elvis's home at 1174 Hillcrest was purchased by Elvis in 1958 for 400,000 and most recently sold for 25.5 million in March of 2019. Marcus Person, creator of Minecraft, purchased an ultra luxury mansion on a Hillcrest for $70 million that came complete with a $30 million car collection and a Louis Vuitton designed bowling alley. Thank you for joining me on this tour of the amazing neighborhood of Truesdale Estates. I hope you found some value in this video. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe so we can continue to make content for you. Whether you're renting, moving, buying, selling, or just exploring, we are always here to help and we love hearing from you. So give us a call, send us a text, or schedule a Zoom. Until next time, stay classy, Los Angeles.